In the next 10 seconds, I'm gonna tell you something incredible. What's the name of a kid who was proclaimed to be better than Pele? If you thought about Robinho, then you're right. But he didn't reach his full potential. So in this video, we are gonna be looking at Robinho's overall career and what happened to him. So in this video, we're gonna be looking at Robinho's overall career and what happened to him? He started in Santos and he was one of the best youngsters in the world. In 2002, the Brazilian led Santos to their first Brazilian Serie A since Pele himself. In the next season, he won the title again. And by this time, everyone knew the kid was kind of a big thing. So, Real Madrid were the club to secure his signature. The transfer was a success at first as he scored 14 goals in 37 appearances, securing two La Liga titles in his entire time at Real Madrid. But from here, everything went downhill for Robinho. After Ronaldo came in at the club, he felt as though he had no place at Real Madrid, so he went to Manchester City. His time here was short, as he only played two seasons in England. He also scored 25 goals in 108 appearances, which is not that bad. He was granted the last chance at AC Milan, as he signed with them in 2010. But even here he couldn't succeed and he had a catastrophic season. He went through many injuries and to add salt to the wound, In 2017, an Italian court convicted Robinho of sexual assault in 2013 gang rape. This was the end of Robinho's football career, as he was sentenced to 9 years in prison. And that's how Robinho went from being Pele's successor to reaching rock bottom.